WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading up 49, NASDAQ's up 133, S&P's up 27. Gold, gold contract uh, trading now $2.80, $2,004.30 an ounce. We have silver up 25 cents, $22.41 an ounce. Late sweet crude trading out down a buck 30 at 76.54 notes and bonds. You get the 10 year note right now trading up 12 ticks at 110 flat. The 30 year up 18 ticks at 118. 17 to 10 year right now, folks, is three is at three point uh, four point two six five. So check this out. For the last three months, the high has been four point five, the low is three point seven, you're at four point two six. And King Dollar. King Dollar right now is down two hundred and forty one ticks. Trading one oh four seven nineteen, yours at one oh seven. Yen's at 150, British pounds at 125 to one US dollar. I'm gonna get over and take a look at the SPY here, folks, okay? You came down hard and fast yesterday. You had volume behind the move. So what you have here is this, okay? The, I suspect we are, we're up $2.95 at 497, right? That being said, what we have here is that when we came down two weeks ago, that also is a high volume low. So the high of that low inside of the SPY is trading at uh, 489. Uh, the bottom of that is 482. My take is that you get a bounce going here. We're gonna basically bounce a little bit more, then come back down into that area. And the faster that we actually do that, the more potential it has to go top side. If you build cars for too long up in this area, then that could turn into a problem. But my take right now is that you're going to get a bounce. What are we at? Uh, is it Wednesday? Yeah, it's, it's Wednesday, okay? So you get a bounce, fires it up again, tries to get back down. The quicker that it tries to get back down there, if you're a bull, the better off it is. Because what ends up happening is that the acceleration, the fast acceleration, which we had yesterday, you had fast volume, fast price moves, um, the bottom line is if you get that again, then it's going to show flat out, do you have more buyers, do you have more sellers? And normally when it comes down very fast like this, the sellers dry up, and guess what? That just means you go topside once again. We'll talk about it as soon as we come back. Stay right there, folks.